Composting is one of the aerobic degradation processes, which is used to degrade various organic wastes, such as municipal solid waste, agricultural waste, toxic terrestrial weeds, aquatic weeds, and hazardous industrial sludges, for producing a value added product compost. In our laboratory, we have been equipped with two technologies, named in vessel composting and vermicomposting. In in vessel composting process, we have two types of reactors, such as batch reactors and continuous reactor. In batch reactors, we have four numbers, 550 liter capacity reactors, which can be fed up to 150 kilograms. These batch reactors are been used to understand the biotransformations of various organic wastes in 20 days and have been recognized as the shortest composting process. It is also utilized for assessing toxic parameters during the process. In pilot scale, we have one fully equipped 5 cubic meters continuous reactor, which can be fed up to 500 kilograms daily, which is a best suitable for decentralized organic waste management. Through this process, depending on the various wastes, the daily marketable compost production varies between 100 to 150 kilograms. Owing to the another best technology, that is vermicomposting technology, which is a superior composting technology, in terms of nutrient value. This traditional composting technique, takes 120 days to produce a value-added product, compost, using a very fresh waste. Now, the group has come up with a novel idea, that is combination of rotary drum composting and stack vermicomposting, to reduce the vermicomposting period. This practice has reduced the duration to 27 days and has succeeded in getting good quality compost. The produced compost in the laboratory, can be used for multiple purposes such as, soil conditioner for eroded soils, biopesticide, and bioinsecticides for agricultural farmlands. The produced compost in the laboratory has been commercially marketized through a startup company Amer, Apishish Management and Environmental Research Private Limited. The company sells the product through online modes such as Amazon and IndiaMart, and offline mode to a large number of farmers and nurseries in Guwahati.